Uh, my name's Craig Lamb and I'm a diagnostic radiographer in the cath labs at LHCH. I mean, working amongst such high levels of radiation all day, every day, it's, gonna, it's stupid for it to not to be a concern. So yeah, um, I mean, I've been a radiographer for the past 10 years, so part of the training it is radiation protection. It's, it's just sort of built in as a, as a function of a radiographer. So from that point, as I'm working with more higher levels of radiation, it just becomes more and more concerning. Uh, to, to achieve as low a dose as possible, there's all the normal things such as keeping flat plates close to patients, using low dose features, trying to reduce the frame rate whenever possible. And the dose aware products to monitor where and when you're receiving dose and how you can overcome this, wearing different lead protection products. I love using the dose wedge for everything. I mean, I know it's technically for monitoring yourself, but we'll use it for putting it around the room to see which areas of the room are better to stand in. We're monitoring the actual patient to see which angles are given more or less dose live, basically, or even putting them on different points of the, the consultant legs, arms, which aren't going to be covered by lead as standard, to show the consultant what their technique is doing, basically, using higher frame rate, what it's, how it's actually affecting them. Because it's so easy to ignore radiation when you don't see it, but when you've got a visual representation in front of you, it's just, it really hits home what's actually happening. I think for me, the, the most I use it is during CTO procedures, when we're going to be screening for a long time, when we're going to be using higher doses, we're going to be using very particular angles for a long period of time. So to be able to monitor the dose for the staff and for the patient, it really it helps a lot in choosing angles and lowering frame rates when necessary, when collimating tightly. For the older generation, the dose aware does illustrate what more lead protection can do because it, it is, it's just not a concern for them, but when they can see, or oh, maybe I'm receiving more dose to my head or to my legs, it makes it more of a priority for them. I mean, I love using dose aware. <laughs> I use it constantly. So I, I, I didn't really go into it with any explanations. I'm a fairly new radiographer. So when I knew there was dose wear, I mean, I didn't have any expectations other than we can monitor dose live and it, it does exactly what it says, I suppose. We use it and it, 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 does, it does a lot for the, the lab.